Hello ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I would like to thank all of you for incredible support within the past few days. It seems like you've been enjoying this type of videos a lot. So thank you so much for 37,000 subs on YouTube. I appreciate that. Today, we're gonna go to a weird place called Labs. Some people say that a lot of miracles tend to happen there. And I don't blame them. This place is scary and unknown to many of us. As soon as I unlocked Therapist level 4, I decided to stock up on some Labs keycards. Right now she sells them 460k, which is not too much. And since whenever you go to Labs, it's empty 50% of the time, it gives you an opportunity to make some cash and uh, get some XP. I've done a couple of raids. Some of them went well, some of them went bad. But nevertheless, let me take you through them. In my first raid, I spawned on the bridge and decided to go for some loots. The closest place was Red Room. There are a couple of really, really good items in there, so let's check them out. Yeah, it's not solo all the time, but pretty likely to be a solo raid. And this is the place where the green keycard spawns. I used the blue keycard model because I didn't have a green one, but yeah, if you do play laps, please do check this place for the green keycard. Very often, I find decent items at the cat's area. I think there is three spawns where you can find lead access, VP access, bitcoins and all the other good stuff. So I usually prioritize looting this area first. What's up, Breaker? Next area is the glass office area where you can find GPUs, lead access and other tech stuffs. Mm -hmm. I killed Sturmund on woods and managed to snag a yellow keycard from him, which was very lucky. And yellow keycard unlocks this room, which potentially can spawn lead access and GPUs. For the rest of the raid, not much interesting has happened, so I just kept looting PCs and filing cabinets in order to find something good. I found lots of wires, lots of uh, power cords which actually go for a really good price on the flea market, something around 40-50k. Um, I found a lion and a bit of other jewelry, and then I decided to leave the raid. Not every single raid goes as good as the previous one, and this raid will be a primal example of it. It's two videos per day. Oh, man. I don't know how my timings are gonna work out. That's a cheater. That's a cheater. He just ran up the stairs and. Yep, magicians on labs do exist. Please do let me know in the comments below if you've met some magicians this wipe already. Little shit hiding behind the door. Oh my. I had a shootout with some players. Even though I died a little bit behind the wall and felt a little bit laggy, um, the guys were legit. GG's to them. Ooh. An essay! That's an essay chat. Damn, that thing is scary. Hey, you can you hear me? Is the SA guy your friend? Nope. He sounds fucking sus, bro. Yeah, I know. Well, you wanna fight or...? I want my ladex for my quest. Where is it? Do, do you have it? I... Uh, no, no, no. 
No? All right. It's fine. We'll find it. We can we can team up if you want. If we find Alex, you can have it. Okay. okay. I mean, you want? Do you want to team up? What? Do you want to team up? Do you want to team up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go. I, I feel I feel like we're gonna get uh, fucked by the SIGA though. Yeah, yeah. Uh, have you checked the parking? The parking for the Lettics? Yep. I teamed up with that fella and he decided to push the SA guy. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens. Are we pushing the guy or what's the plan? <laughs> Instantly had eyes, bro. Instantly had eyes, chat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Seems like my guy is not getting the Ladex. Easy. I started getting low on money, so bringing out a Vapor Hunter was a viable option. A cheap gun, M80. Let's clap some Raiders. Alright, chat. Empty raid? Empty raid or head eyes from Xiao Xiao? What are we getting this time? You know what I wanna... Please, no, I'm new! What? Hello, hello. You speak English? Hello. Yeah, I do speak oh, English. Oh, finally, bro. Where are you from? The UK. Nice. I kept I kept getting head eyes from Xiao Xiao for the past few raids. There's also another guy here. Really? You heard him or he's, he's your he teammate? Voice lining. I heard him voice lining. Yeah, well, it wasn't me. I spawned on the other side next to um, next to server room. Didn't Quite see, didn't hear anyone. Room. Oh, server? Yeah, yeah. Well, I, yeah, I heard him voice lining. After chit chatting for a bit, we decided to fight. To you, bro. Yeah, we can I don't mind. Fight. Yeah, let's fight, let's fight. Sure. You wanna fight? Alright, let's go. GG chat. GG. After so many deaths and so much disappointment, I knew that the good raid is coming. Yeah, no worries, look, it's all good. No worries, bro. Квест, где у Егера нужно убить штурмана и сдать его ключ. Не помню, как называется. Хранитель леса, что-то такого плана. After running around and looting for a bit, I finally spotted some dead bodies. I wasn't sure if it's a red or a PMC, but I decided to take my chance. It is a player. Is he under? First time in the long term, my heart is actually pumping, chat. My heart is actually pumping. 
All right. After the lobby is more or less clear, it's time to loot and get the hell out. Bro, the real problem was my weight. I could barely move. So instead of taking all of this downstairs in one go, I decided to split the loot into three different groups. After getting all of my treasure downstairs, I had to do some rearrangement in order to fit as many items as possible and to maximize my profits. And then I had to carry 100kg of loot straight into the elevator. And surely I successfully extracted. This is it for today. Thanks so much for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.